Hey, welcome back to my channel. Um, these readings are for entertainment purpose only. Um, I call myself very being very intuitive. Um, I can look at the cards and not happen to read the cards. But anyways, let's get into it. We're going to do Gemini's reading. We're going to start off with Gemini's love reading. Okay. Let's see what messages for Gemini love reading. Gemini's love reading. I just heard it stop. As much as I try to go ahead and lay these out, and I just can't. <laughs> I have to get in the groove. Okay, this is the energy of the relationship. This is what they're feeling in their heart and their emotions. This is what to expect. You may not be able to see all the cards. And this is what in their head space, okay? So, Gemini, I feel like you're, like, moving very slow. Something is moving very slow. Um, I don't usually call out the signs because, like, you may have it in your North Node, Venus, Mercury. Like, I don't even know my Mercury. Like, I don't even know my North Node. So, like, it's unnecessary to, like, call out each sign. So, okay, I feel like you're, I call the um, Knight of Pentacles something that you're very, moving very slow about. I also call it the um, measure twice before you cut card. So I feel like you're very, moving very slow. I feel like whatever relationship that's around it, because it's the Pentacle and it's the Knight of Pentacles, I feel like it's a stable energy, but it's just moving really slow right now. And we're going to see what is moving really slow, okay? So the energy, I feel that with the Queen of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles being next to each other, I also feel like you're just on guard, okay? Like, I feel like you have feelings for someone or someone may have feelings for you, but they have been hurt, okay? They have, um you know, experience loss. That's why they're moving slow, okay? That's why they're cutting. They're measuring twice before they're cut, before they cut, okay? Now, how they're feeling deep down in their emotions, I feel like you bring them some type of happiness, okay? I still feel like, you know, they're very optimistic, but I still feel like they're on guard, okay? That's why they're moving slow, now, what's to it? I should have went here first. I know next time. Because I usually don't do this spread. Um, what to expect here is some type of offer. Some type of emotional offer. And I feel like this person is very solid. But I still feel like they're on guard. You know, they're trying to make a, the right decision, okay? And I still feel like... They're doing a lot of thinking as well, okay, with the Queen of Swords. You know, she's very on guard, okay? And she is the type to measure twice to, before she cut, okay? Because she has been there. She has been there, done that, and got the T-shirt, okay? Now, what's in their headspace and what's in your headspace? I feel like you guys want some type of changing event, okay? With the sun and the wheel of fortune, I definitely feel like there's something changing. And I feel like it's for the better, okay? And here, and then we have the hangman at the bottom. I don't read reversals. So I feel like with the hangman being um at the bottom with the knight of pentacles and the queen of swords, I definitely feel like there's some type of relationship. I feel like someone is moving slow. I feel like somebody, someone is on guard, okay? But I still feel like things are being balanced out. Like, you know, even though this person may be moving slow, I feel like, you know, they're just trying to make sure they make the right decision when it comes to this relationship, okay? Because some type of offer is coming. 
okay, is um to be expected, okay? Let's clarify the Queen of Swords. I said that. So I feel like with this Queen of Swords, I feel like she has been disappointed. That's why she's moving slow. I said that. I said that whoever you're messing with or this could be your energy, I definitely feel like you care for this person or the person um cares for you. But I feel like I said that they've been there, done that, and got the t-shirt. So that's why they're on guard. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I feel like they care. I definitely feel like they're moving slow. I mean, look at these. This is this is the pow the most positive card in the deck. Okay, so I definitely feel like this person. I feel like you make this person happy, but I feel like you or the other person has been hurt. So they're just moving very cautiously. Okay, clarify the sun. One for the sun. Okay. So with the sun, I feel like in their emotions, I feel like I, I'm telling you, I don't even have to read the cards. I'm definitely feeling like somebody has been through a lot. They see you as like a potential um being a, a, a great partner to them, but I still feel like they had to leave a lot of things behind. You know, uh, especially like mistrust, being hurt, being cheated on, losing a husband, um, not being able to bear kids or, uh, 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 et cetera, et cetera. But I still feel like they had to move away from that type of energy, okay? Because the sun is here. Like, I feel like you make them happy or you feel... Look, it was said at the bottom. Didn't I say you feel like... I feel like you make them happy, okay? You definitely make them happy, but I still feel like they just on guard because they have been, they have seen a lot, okay? Clarify the Knight of Cups. One for the Knight of Cups, please, and thank you. Okay. So, I feel like with this offer, I definitely feel like there could be a new beginning. I wonder, when I said the word pregnancy, I wonder, does this mean that someone could become pregnant? Because I said something about pregnancy. I don't recall what I said. I don't, I can't recall, but I remember hearing the word pregnancy. But anyways, I feel like this person definitely want to offer you a new beginning, okay? I, like I said before, I feel like you're like the apple. I always say that. <laughs> But the page of one to me is like the F, uh you the apple of my eye. Uh I hope that makes some sense here. Clarify the will of fortune. Then the will of fortune. Oh, two came out. Look, these fell out. I don't read reversals. Kind of having like anxiety, sleepless night about a new beginning. I'm telling you, like this person really cares, but I feel like they have seen, like just like you growing up and you seen all your friends get played and stuff after they had a baby by someone, okay? Now that has been stuck in your head. Like you have that fear. You feel what I'm saying? And it's just something that just always had plagued you, plagued you. So now you're in a relationship, you're meeting someone and like they're talking about, you know, let's get married. You know, that's giving you goosebumps. Then you're talking about kids and that's even giving you anxiety. Like, wait a minute, hold on. Like, let's, let's go slow. Like, let me put my, my, my plan together. Clarify the will of fortune. That's how I feel about this reading. Like, I'm telling you, this person wants victory with you. They want to change things. Like, I feel like things are going to change. This is in their headspace, what they're thinking. I feel like they, they want things to change, okay? They want things to change or have some type of victory with you. I'm hearing that they want you to believe in them. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. 
terrified of my expenses. Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles. What are they being slow to do? Partner up. Oh, that fell. Okay. Can I say that? I definitely feel like this person want to move forward, but they're like in their head. They can't make a decision, okay? Like they're on their way, but I feel like it's a lot of things stopping them. And what's stopping them is like previous hurt. I don't know why I just heard that, okay? So I feel like in their emotions, I feel like they definitely want to come to you. Um, I feel like they have even been disappointed with past offers. You know what I'm saying? I feel like there's some disappointment, disappointment in past offers. And this is in their emotional energy, okay? I feel like what they're thinking, you know, being indecisive, wanting to move forward, you know. But I still feel like they're on guard. You know, look at her, how she's looking. She just had the swords ready. Just She looking like, look, look how she look. Like, don't even come to me, okay? Don't come to me with the bull crap, okay? Been there, done there, got the t-shirt. So I feel like somebody very in denial. They want to move forward, but they are definitely on guard, okay? I feel like their energy, they definitely want to have some type of victory with you. And they want the attention as well, I want to say, okay? But what's in... What they're thinking is they want to make sure that they move, you know, not move, but I, I feel like they want to definitely um, calculate their steps. Okay. They want to measure twice before they're cut, before they cut. Like, I feel like they're on the way because this is a trustworthy night, but he's very cautious. You know, you see, he's looking back already like the horse is ready to go, but he's like, whoa, I heard something. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's like, I'm on the way, but let me, you know what I'm saying, stop and look at the roses and everything else and let that be the reason why I'm taking my time because he really want to make sure they make the right decision, okay? So I feel like, because this is a lot of positivity here, okay? With the Empress, the Sun, and the Wheel of Fortune, I feel like there's a growth. There's blessings over this relationship. And I feel like things are going to turn around for the um good, you know, with the Wheel of Fortune. I mean, these are all positive cards. One thing I can say about the Gemini reading, if I want to go ahead and conclude this, I want to say that I feel like the person or you are very into, you know, whomever you're dating. But I feel like there's a lot of slow energy because somebody has been hurt before. Okay. This person has been hurt before, okay? So, all I want to say is to, like, take your time with this person, okay? Take your time with this person, okay? Give them time, okay? Give them some time, okay? Because you both feel like, you know, you guys can, like, conquer the world. I don't know why I just heard a uh, 2 Chain song with, um... Ariana, Ariana Grande. Um, I just realized that we can rule the world. Y'all know that song. Okay. Matter of fact, you might have to um Google it or look it up on YouTube. But I definitely just heard that song like we can rule the world. But yeah, this has been the conclusion. Take your time, give this person enough time and show them the attention or give the Gemini the attention that they need to know that, you know, hey, this is where I want you to be and this is where I want to be. Okay, this concludes the Gemini reading. Thank you for watching. Please tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. Um, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks.